Sri Sai Ram, thought for the day. Your mind can cause bondage. It can also confer liberation. It is an amalgam of the passionate, rajasic, and ignorant, tamasic attitudes. It is easily polluted. It relishes in hiding the real nature of things and casting on them the forms and values that it desires. Hence, the activities of the mind must be regulated. The mind has two characteristics. First, it runs helplessly up to the senses. Whichever sense the mind follows, it is inviting disaster. When a pot of water becomes empty, we need not infer that it has leaked away through ten holes. One hole is enough to empty it. So too, even if one sense is not under control, you will be thrown into bondage. Hence, master all senses. Second, the potency of the mind can be promoted by good practices like meditation, repetition of the name, devotional singing, and worship. With the strength and skill thus reinforced, the mind can be tuned to help spiritual progress. Sutra Bahini, Chapter 1 Baba.